Kendall's perspective going into the series final is hinted to by Succession star Jeremy Strong with a Game of Thrones illusion. The penultimate episode of Succession aired after Logan's funeral, and throughout the show, Kendall positions himself to succeed his father as the true heir apparent if he is successful in stopping the Gojo deal. When Kendall steps in to deliver Logan's eulogy since Roman is unable to do so, he puts on a show for the second time in the season final. Strong was questioned about Kendall's perspective going into the Succession series finale while he was a guest on the most recent episode of HBO's official Succession podcast. In his response, the Emmy-winning actor made an allusion to another renowned HBO show, Game of Thrones, calling it a Dracarys moment for Kendall. For Kendall, it's somewhat a Dracarys moment. Really, I think he can see the big picture starting at the conclusion of episode 6. In the ninth episode, a lot of things go place. He has completely compromised himself and he is aware of it by feeling responsible for the election and accepting responsibility for striking this type of Faustian bargain. I believe he is distressed. The genuine moral peril that was depicted in the prior episode. However, Rava confronted him about it, removed the children from the city, and just later joined the defection. In a way, I love that they gave Juliana Canfield's character Jess, who is such a beautiful character and an excellent actor, this fantastic scene. However, she is practically one of Kendall's last few remaining friends. Everybody else has left. Shiv and Tom are in a relationship, and we observe relationships between other characters as well. Kendall's relationship with Jess is kind of the one area where he feels safe, so for it to come from there is a really lethal wound. He persists, but I believe that has somewhat dislodged him, which only makes him more determined to get his way. I believe he is simply increasing his bet. Strong appears to be alluding to the penultimate episode of Game of Thrones, The Bells, in which a furious Daenerys rides Drogon and burns down King's Landing, claiming many innocent lives in the process. Danny then effectively assumes the role as Queen of the Ashes before being slain by Jon shortly after. Although the penultimate episode of Succession, Church and State, doesn't have as many actual deaths, Logan's funeral does serve as Kendall's coronation. He then starts recruiting a lot of Logan's previous allies, including his former security guard Colin, and he designates Hugo as his dog. Kendall's Dracarys moment likewise occurs after he has lost some of the people who mean the most to him, much to Donnie's Dracarys moment, which was inspired in part by the loss of Jura Mormont and Miss Andy. Kendall's ex-wife Rava removes their children from the city before Logan's funeral, and his assistant Jess informs him that she is moving on. Kendall will probably wind up like Logan and Daenerys in the Succession series final, isolated from everyone around him and destined to spend the rest of his life in agony.